Hi everyone, welcome back to another video with Royal Crypto. Today in this video, we are going over on how to get reward in cryptocurrency on Brave Browser. And uh, if you're watching this video, it means that you know Brave Browser. If you don't know Brave Browser, please go ahead and watch my previous video on how to install it and why you should consider Brave Browser. Uh, let me give you a hint right here before you watch that. Brave Browser is almost the most secure browser that respects your privacy and does not sell your data. And it only shows you ads that you want and for watching those ads, it gives you uh, rewards in cryptocurrency. So if you already watched that video and you installed it or you already know about it, uh, you open Brave Browser. As you can see, when you open Brave Browser, you see that everything looks more modern. It's a more modern version of Chrome, but uh, considering more privacy. So all of those privacy holes that were in uh, Chrome Browser are now removed. And this is a more secure and more modern browser that gives you rewards. Uh, for example, one of the features that it makes more uh, secure is when you're uh, browsing a private tab, it's already uh, encrypted with Tor uh, VPN and proxy. So when you open a browser tab, uh, it's connected to Tor and it's connected to DuckDuckGo. So anything you search will uh, stay anonymous. But that's not the topic of this video. I already explained that in the previous video. So, Brave Browser gives you rewards for watching ads. One of the ads that you watch is these wallpapers that are behind the new tab. So, once you refresh, you see they're actually really nice too. I like them. Once you refresh, you see I have 5.675, right? The more of these you watch, the more uh you get reward so for example if you watch this uh if you let this open you do your other work and you let this open uh, on the side and you get like 0.15 bat that's one way of earning and that's not the uh, best way of earning so uh, this uh, watching this gives you a little bit of bat and um, there are some other ways you can get a uh, brave reward when you go to setting you click on uh, you toggle on the ad button so it says earn tokens by viewing brave ads ads presented are based on your interests as inferred from your browser behavior no personal data or browsing history ever leaves your browser so what does this do it makes a local uh, part of your computer, your interest on what your interests are. And based on that, it shows you ad. Whereas in other browsers, your interest and your behavior are saved on a cloud that they're accessed to at any time. But these are saved on your own computer. So your personal data never leaves anywhere else beside your computer. And you are allowing them to show you ads. And, uh, for ads, there are options. There is one ad per hour, up to five ad per hour. I put five ad per hour. And you choose your location. For my location, it's California. As you can see, uh, I'm using Brave this month uh, for this video uh, to show you. And this month so far, I got 529 ads. And the ads are not annoying and nothing. They just pop up next to your computer and if you want to click on it, it goes to that website. If you don't want, you don't click on it. Either way, it gives you uh, the amount. And you can see this is the seven day history, uh, seven day uh, ad history. So in the past seven day, I got 529 ads. Uh, and for these 529 ads, they only popped up only maybe 20 times. And the rest of it never popped up, and it just shows a number right here. And uh, for these ads that I received, I got 5.675 bat, and uh, that currently costs 6.65 dollar. 
you may think what if but but if the basic attention token and uh, it's based on ethereum and the reason the goal of this token is to distribute the advertising money between the publishers and the users and why i say the publisher because some people may not get uh, the money for their ads and instead uh, you can auto contribute so once you click on auto contribute uh, brave browser looks which website you went to so i went to google lingvertise and these and these and it automatically contributes your bad meaning it gives your bad to them and to honor uh, their service but you can do that but if you want to keep it for yourself make sure to turn auto contribute off so once you turn off auto contribute what happens to your bad so every month there's a specific day for payment day so i have 5.675 bat and uh, my next payment date is April 5, meaning on April 5, they sent 5.675 bat into my wallet. And you may think, where is your wallet? Your wallet on your computer. And your wallet is on your computer, so this goes to a wallet on which is on your PC. And to save this uh, into a virtual wallet, where you can add fund, you can remove fund, you can trade, or you can send it to Binance, or you can send it to Qcoin, or exchange it to US dollar and use it, you need something called an uphold account, right here, uphold of account. Uh, to make an uphold account, you need to have 25 bat in your local wallet, and after that, you can uh, get any amount of bat you want. And to make an uphold upon, there is only a trick that you need to do KYC. And what is KYC? KYC, knowing your customer, meaning that you have to upload your address and your uh, ID if you are in the United States. And that's it. Some other things that you can do uh, if you can uh, tip the people you like. For example, if you want to tip my channel, you go to Rules of Games YouTube channel, and my channel is specifically Brave. Uh, it's Brave Verified. So I'm a Brave Verified creator. You go there, send the tip. That's one way you can use your. Um, rewards if you don't want to do the KYC you can just tip uh, people you like the content creators you like and one more last thing I want to show you is uh, this 5.675 that I have is not always 6.65 dollar it may cost way more it may cost less but currently we can see that previously the bad basic attention token was a uh, couple days ago one dollar and 39 cents but uh, currently as of um, uh, today uh, it's one dollar and 17 cents but however if it breaks the resistance level it definitely goes up again to 1.39 and if there is a good uh, uh, pump over there it may move uh, way above uh, the previous resistance level and uh, it moved up more than 1.39 but let's see uh, I remember before when I started uh, using Brave Browser uh, each bat was like 30 cents so right here if you had a 5 bat uh, it was like 90 cents but just in couple of months right now if you have a and then like even a week ago uh, 5 baht was like $5 and right, right now it's 5.6 baht is $6.65 so that's the good part uh, so you can even if you create that Apple account you can trade your bats to other things like 
Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, or you can also trade it to uh, Tether and then change that to US dollars. Anyway, if you have any question about it, uh, feel free to comment below. I respond as soon as possible. Thank you so much for watching this video and have a good day.